I strongly believe that love is something you must do and show every day and in every moment. And over the last 11 years, you've shown me what a lifetime with you could be. A life filled with laughter, love and happiness. A life where we support each other through the hardest of times and celebrate with each other through the best. You've become my best friend and the love of my life. And I feel incredibly lucky to be marrying you. David, for almost 12 years we've shared so much laughter and so many amazing memories. You are my rock, my best friend, my person, my true love. And I stand before you today, finally, <laughs> in front of all of our favourite people to make a promise. I promise to love and cherish you for all the days of my life. One of the things I love most about our relationship is the laughter we share. From the mad Frenchman to Jimmy Carr to the mime, your laughter lights up my world. <laughs> your sense of humour is witty, weird and wonderful. I promise to always cherish your laughter and do my best to keep it alive. To find the joy in the little things and to create a life filled with moments that make us laugh to our bellies ache. We've travelled the world together from the breathtaking beaches of Barra to the jungles of Thailand. I know travel is your passion and I promise to continue exploring the world with you hand in hand. As we know, the first time we met wasn't one of those classic love at first sight moments, but instead became the foundation on which our entire relationship was built. The ability to laugh with one another and more often than not at each other. Our story so far is one of love and happiness from exploring new countries, enjoying wine and great food to simply cozying up together in our favourite place, our home. I vow to continue to explore the world with you to always seek out new adventures and to create unforgettable memories while also being there as your couch buddy for countless Netflix binges and late night gaming marathons. I promise to support you, to listen to you and be your player too in any game. I vow to choose you every day, to hold you close to my heart, and to always be by your side through all the adventures life has in store for us. I promise to never take you for granted and to spend the rest of my days showing you just how much you mean to me. My heart is yours. I vow to love and treasure you for who you are and to always encourage you to be your best self. You are the yin to my yang, the calm to my chaos, and the love of my life. I vow to spend the rest of my days making you feel as special and loved as you make me feel every day. I promise to put you first and to never lose our spark. Together, I believe we will be unstoppable, and I'm so excited to embark on this journey with you as your wife. I pledge to love you not only as my husband, but as my best friend, and I promise to never stop laughing with you, forever and always. I love you. Do you, David? I Take do. me cool. <laughs> <laughs> Key, much? Oh. <laughs> Do you, David, take Nicole here present to be your lawful wedded wife? I do. Yay! <laughs> very keen, Nicole. And do you, Nicole, take David here present 
to be your lawful wedded husband. I do. David and Nicole, you have both made the declarations prescribed by law and you have made a solemn and binding contract with each other in the presence of your witnesses, your family and friends, all gathered here this afternoon in your honour. It is my privilege and pleasure to tell you that you are now lawfully married. You are husband and wife. Congratulations. And David, you may kiss your beautiful bride. Welcome everyone to this very special and happy occasion. Well Nikki, now it's your big day. And it's a big day for your mum and me too. Because we finally managed to get you married off. <laughs> Dave, I'm sorry fella, we were desperate. I have to compliment you, Nicky, on your choice of Middleton Lodge. What an outstanding venue. You have an eye for quality and expensive taste. <laughs> and we know where you get that from, don't we, Renati? Your mum and I are very proud of what you've achieved as also you should be, and I think that deserves a round of applause. We must look at David and Nicole today and think, wow, how lucky are they to have what they have? Yeah, it may have been fate that brought them together, but to say it's all fate is a discredit to them both. They haven't got just any ordinary relationship. They have devoted themselves to each other for 11 years, dedicating themselves to each other through thick and thin, evolving together as dynamics change and tackling challenges as they are thrown their way. And even today, are still learning things about each other and will continue to do so. Now that is something to idolise. So today we aren't just celebrating them becoming husband and wife, but celebrating a whole 11 years of loving each other. Now that is pretty amazing. Can everybody raise their glasses? Here's to David and Nicole, 11 years strong and 100 more to come. Let me turn my attention to the most radiant presence in the room my amazing bride, Nicole. You look incredibly, outrageously beautiful today. But of course, that was never going to be a shock. Now, although it was me who got down on one knee and proposed, I can't take all the credit for today. Today has been the making of the brilliant and beautiful bride. Nikki has planned, toiled, stressed, unplanned, panicked, and planned some more. We almost got married in Crete. <laughs> Nikki has worked really hard to make today perfect and I really hope it's everything you've always dreamed it would be. 
barring getting married to Pedro Pascal, of course. <laughs> Nicole, I read that to find true love, you must first find a true friend. And I have without a doubt found my best friend in you. I asked you to marry me because I knew I wanted to spend the rest of my life with you. And I'm so happy you said yes. So that from this day, in front of everyone we know and love, I get to be your husband and call you my wife. <laughs>